I started playing football when I was five years old. Um, and growing up, that was my dream was to play in the NFL. When my career came to an end, I was kind of, I was kind of uh, prepared for that. I feel as a lot of players aren't prepared for that. When they're, when they're done, whether it's by choice or not by choice, they can you know, reach a point of depression or hit a, many uh, mental barriers. Um, but, for, but for me, I kind of you know, had that plan and I set it up. And as they say, they say the NFL stands for not for long. So I actually wanted to be a lawyer growing up to get him out of prison. Um, that was kind of like my second decision after being an NFL player. Um, so I guess you could say I had interest in the field. A lot of players, when they get done playing football, it's so easy to stay in the football realm. Um, but for me personally, I figured, you know, my whole life I've been a football player and I wanted to be something different for once. Um, and that's why I joined HTSO. I'd say getting badge was an awesome milestone in my law enforcement career. And it kind of put my eyes on the realization of that I'm no longer just a football player, that I'm also, you know, a cop as well. I can do something else with my life because growing up, you know, from the age of five years old all the way to when I got that badge pinned, I was just a football player and I didn't know, you know, very much else. But I'm happy to uh, serve and make an impact on the community in many different ways. For someone that doesn't have the path that they, you know, planned, I would tell them that they can perfect their path, you know, in many different ways. For an athlete, that doesn't have a path that's planned, I would tell them that at the end of the day, they're not just a person in a jersey and on the television, that they can affect the community in so many different other ways and make that positive influence. At both of the colleges I was at and when I was with the Baltimore Ravens, family stood for forget about me, I love you. And I think HCSO, um, does an awesome way of showing that. If this episode of Before the Badge has inspired you to protect and serve your community, we are currently hiring law enforcement, detention, and civilian positions. Go to joinhcso.com to learn more.